Hey guys, so this is Michael with Blue Roots, and I'm going to show you real fast how to make a gift file. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and click on New, our Command N in Photoshop, and then set your settings. I have 500 by 480, and I set my resolution to 300. And then what we're going to do is, is just, you can even name it. Um gift project get that out of the way and then click OK alright and then you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna select your files drop those in and while you're importing them just hit enter boom 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 okay and then I'm also gonna add a text to go overlaying of this that says um, congrats Okay, Oop, where you go? There you go. Oop. Go ahead, center that. You can add an effect to it if you want. Blending options. I'm just going to click a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, no, that's going to be ugly. There you go. And yeah, okay. And so then, what you're going to do after that is you're going to go click on Windows. Click timeline and then create a new timeline. All right, and so this is the new video setting that is in Photoshop. And so what you're going to do is is you're just going to take and I'm going to actually bring this GIF file down to here, the time on this, and then I'm going to take and I'm just going to kind of stagger this stuff out, um, so that you know. There you go. Just so that it's not, um, you know, you want to make sure that wherever you set it, probably need to just set it right there because it doesn't need that long, is that these files right here do not need to overlap because if they overlap, you know, this is what they're going to do. See, and that's not cool. And so then you cake and you do that do that so the only thing that we have overlapping here and I'll just bring this over just for intents and purpose is that is going to be the congrats so make sure that you have loop for that on there and then just click play and you can see your gift file in action looky there we are like less than three minutes into this video so then you're going to go to file and click save for web or you can use that little whatever that is right there and then you're going to want to make sure that you select a gif format this is kind of ugly if you want to go for that go ahead with it it's restricted um, i'm going to do 64 that way um, you can even drop it down to 126 and then you can change your um, settings here. You can even um, quality or your percentage right there. And just change all these different settings the way you want to set it. And then make sure that you have looping options forever. Click on play animation to see how this works. What? All right. So then you're going to go ahead and click save. I'm going to save this desktop um, GIF project. Oop, and that's what I want to call it GIF project. And then, yep, that's going to be it. Click save. Then click over here. And then there's your gift. I'll click and make it bigger. Oh. There you go. All the info is below. And check out my links. Twi tweet me, ask me questions, you know, the whole nine yards. Um, BlueRootsMM.com should be coming up soon. And that'll have some more resources for you. And I hope this helps. Peace out, and y'all create something.